Hi, this is Randy Schooneman from Bulldog Rooter. I'm out today uh, doing a video inspection of a main line with uh, Ernie from Bulldog Rooter at 5536 Pacific Park Drive in Spokane, Washington. Uh, excuse me, 5536 West Pacific Park Drive. Um, I'm using a new camera and I think the uh, footage may be off on the uh, counter but it's showing me 136 feet which uh, seems a bit long to me. Right now we're looking at a concrete sewer line that's out in uh, West Pacific Park Drive, runs uh, pretty much east and west roughly and we're going to start pulling back and see the condition of this main line. Right here we immediately transition into PVC, it's a 4 inch PVC material and we're coming back and I'm just going to read off the footages as I get, as I'm pulling back uh, but there's no guarantee on accuracy on the footage. Right here we're at about 130 feet. Uh, looks like we have really good grade through this line. Uh, I don't see any standing water. Uh, I don't see any uh, imperfections or problems with the walls of the pipe. Uh, a lot of times if this is laid against a rock or anything we'll get a, a bump or a blister on the inside wall of the pipe. Uh, this area dirt wise is predominantly sand. What we're seeing is uh, condensation on the top of the pipe. Uh, Aspect-wise, excuse me, right now we're sitting at about 100 feet according to what the camera's telling me. Uh, let's see, the bottom of the pipe is always going to be where the light is at, and as you can see it's on the uh, left-hand side of your screen. We'll just, this aspect will probably change as we pull back towards the house and uh, go through various elbows. Right now it's showing me 90 feet, continuing to pull back, a couple of fittings right here, coming up on 80 feet, line is still looking good with respect to grade, don't see any blisters or bumps on those walls which is good. Uh, another little fitting here and a rubber gasket at that fitting. Uh, those are typically not seen inside the pipe. Just past the 70 foot mark and working towards 60. This is 60 feet right here, continuing to pull back, a little fitting there, looks all nice and round, don't see any ovalization in the pipe. Possibly a little bit of a root growth there, uh, could just be some uh, food type debris that's washed out from the house. Another fitting. Uh, bottom of the pipe now is switched to the lower right hand portion of your screen. Uh, we're coming up on 40 feet according to the camera reel. Coming up on 30 feet here pretty rapidly. Right here is 30. continuing to look really good in terms of grade. We've been flushing toilets and running water to see if we have any areas of pooling water. A little bit of a bend here at 16 feet. This is going to be just right outside the front of the house. Continuing to pull back. Now it's 10 feet right here. Uh, at 7 feet you can see a change of color in the pipe. This is ABS. Uh, so we're probably within about uh, 5 feet of the outside foundation wall. Uh, everything inside the house is typically ABS or PVC. Uh, ABS is white, or excuse me, PVC is white, my apologies, and uh, ABS of course is black. And so right now we're really close to the house and I can hear my camera 
getting close to the clean out. And we're right at the base of the clean out right here. We're looking down at where the house drain comes out. Okay, and we're going to pull up and out of the clean out. And this is where we're at in the basement family room. Again, this is Randy Schooneman with along with uh, Ernie out here at uh, 5536 West Pacific Park Drive in Spokane, Washington. That'll conclude this video inspection of the main line. Thank you for choosing Bulldog Rooter.